Hi, I'm Brent Lord, the creator of GoButton. In this introduction to GoButton, I'm going to show you how to create your first show. First, let's look at the GoButton home screen. This is where you manage your shows and access the GoButton settings. Tap on any of your shows to open it in the player. This is where you run your show. On iPad, this screen has the Go and Stop buttons, the Queue list, the Elapsed Show Timer, the Armed Queue Info Panel, and the Hits Panel. The compact iPhone version leaves out the Info Panel and Hits. Next, let's create a new show. I have some character voiceovers that I need to play over some underscore. Then on a visual cue, I need to crossfade to some different entrance music. Here's how I'm going to do that with Go Button. On the home screen, tap the plus button, enter a name, and tap save. Tap add cue to display the media picker. My music tracks are in my iTunes library, and I imported the voiceover files earlier from an email attachment, so it's in my documents folder. Tap Add, and Go button creates my new cues. You can also insert cues in the middle of your show. Just select an existing cue in the cue list, tap Add Cue, and Go button will insert the new cues right in that spot. So this audio file has some dead air, so I'm going to trim that up. You can preview changes right in the editor. Nope! I ain't seen that crazy cat anywheres! We also cut a line after we recorded the voiceovers, so let's remove that from the queue as well. I ain't seen that crazy cat anywheres! Tap Save to exit. Last, I need my underscore music to stop when the entrance music begins. To do that, select Q4 and tap Edit Q. These are the queue presets that make it easy to create some of the most common types of queues. But for this queue, we are going to tap Customize to reveal the detailed queue settings. Turn on Stop Others and set a 3 second fade out to make a nice smooth crossfade. Tap Save and then tap Done. Now I'm ready to play my show. Tap the first cue to arm it, then tap Go to play each cue in this show. Hey there, Funky Bunch! I ain't seen that crazy cat anywheres! Now let's look at Hits, a special Go button feature only available on iPad. Hits let you easily play ad-libbed or repeated sound effects. Yeah! Tap and hold on a single hit to stop it early. This laser gun could be a little more responsive, so let's fix that up. Tap Edit, then tap on the hit to open the Hit Edit screen. Let's trim this hit to remove the dead air. You double tap to zoom in, and you can preview your changes right in the editor. Tap Save and Done to return to the player. So that's an introduction to cues and hits and just some of what is possible with GoButton. GoButton is available worldwide on the App Store. Thanks for watching and I look forward to hearing what you do with GoButton.